Jack and I have never been that close together oh for gosh. that much time. Yes. In a large uh, doll. We, large we doll. generally have at least a, an arm's length. Yes. Yes. You've been practicing social distancing for years. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> from, yeah. from your yeah. brother. Which is, I'm done with you. Bye. Oh, multi platinum pop superstar, Panther! Oh, my God. Moment one, we knew we were gonna be the first group playing on the show, and so it was immediately apparent that we need to try and make the most of that and, and make it more than just here's three singers, but make a game of it. Wow! Is that two voices? Make an adventure of it for the audience to kind of, oh, oh, what's going on here? I don't know what I'm seeing. What? Oh my God, oh, you guys! That added to the fun for us. Oh my God! In Rwanda! a blast to just be a part of a production that's all about music. I mean, yeah. you get asked to do different things, obviously being a band, having played shows for our whole lives, you're used to standing with the guitar, standing with the keyboard. This is a challenge, you know, it's a different kind of challenge. Yeah, a fun challenge. You know, I don't think we've done this much, almost acapella like singing in probably 25 no years. No guitar solos, no drum no, solos, well, yeah, no guitar solos, no drum no, solos, no, no, solo, well, yeah, no guitar solos, no, no guitar solos, no, uh, yeah, no. <laughs> just straight singing. Which means no guitar solos or drum solos to screw up. Yeah, that's, that's true. That's actually oh. that's true. Yeah, just Ooh. choreography. <laughs> yeah. We almost fell off the stage a couple times. Yes. Um, <laughs> yes and the la uh, lack of peripheral vision definitely created some, you know, gasping in the audience. <laughs> okay, here we are inside. Here's what we actually see uh, while we're on stage. We see easy. Yeah, nothing. You really can't see much inside. No, yeah. I mean, hmm. people think about, you know, your, your peripheral vision. So when you're singing, you're performing, that's one thing you realize right out of the gate is, wow, yeah. I don't really know exactly where I am. And projecting, I think, like I said, sure. singing inside, you know, you, you have to embrace the fact that, you know, the mic is right there attached to you and you got to think about moving. Come on, put your We spent most of our lives avoiding doing dance moves or wearing matching outfits. It took the mass Singer to make it happen. Yeah, exactly. so consider yourself lucky. As long as we've been doing it, whenever you get the chance to do something different, something different. I think there was actually something kind of liberating about being in this anonymous costume. <laughs> You just you just kind of have fun with it, and you just go. Listen, this is purely about the entertainment factor of Absolutely. making these dolls into a character. No guitar solos. No Felt like this gift to be able to have something that we could perform and do at a time where we can't be on do stage shows. and performing for fans. And so yeah. to be able to do something like this, this is something that oftentimes you'd be on tour somewhere halfway around the world. Exactly. And you wouldn't idea, be able to do it. You wouldn't even be able to do a show where you have yeah. to be in a place for you know weeks on end. Those are harmonies. I think we have three incredible singers here. Right, but but Robin, I want to remind you, there could be four. There could be five. Well, we definitely like the fact that it's this kind of gradual reveal of how many people are in the doll and so so it was immediately apparent that we need to try and make the most of that and, and make it more than just here's three singers and so forth and the costume team did a fantastic job of figuring out how to how to make it all work oh my god they're so cute the show is an amazing production i mean you have audio visual you have the graphics you have the costumes you have yeah. all the different performances it's been kind of an awe inspiring thing to watch yeah, just I to know. see it all come together the music team how fast they're pulling those songs together from nothing to a perfect recreation of the original records is really, 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 really impressive. There's such a, a huge uh, contributing experience with the stage show that's going on. It feels alive, and of course, the, the panelists do a good job of when, when they are into something, they are acting like a fan. They are listening and dancing and grooving, and you can see that energy, what little we can see through the door. <laughs> you can channel that. Yes! Man, they still standing, y'all. We were put in the category of some great acts during the show. We yeah. had the Jacksons, we had Boys to Men, we had Sugarland. Sugarland, yeah. Great singers, so I think that was a compliment. Yeah, it, it, 
Gosh, this is so delightfully tough to figure out. But Nicole, she got it first. Yeah. Props to her. Third episode. Yeah. Handsome. Who could sang their handsome. Off. Yeah, I sent her a text message. <laughs> Guys, you made mass singer history. This is the first time we've ever had a handsome on our show. Well, it's been a blast. Taking risks is important. I mean, reaching out and trying things and stretching yourself. Otherwise, yeah. you're, you're going backwards. And so whether it's starting a record company, you know, years ago when nobody was doing that, or just forging ahead and kind of continuing to make music despite anything else that's going around you and saying, hey, this is my passion. Um, mm -hmm. This show is a great example of trying something new. Yeah. And so hopefully people watch it and, and they're saying, hey, I can, I, I'd be willing to take a chance and put myself in a new situation and yeah. you know, jump out there. Yeah. Yeah. I think the biggest risk was uh, that we might go out in the first episode and then realize, like, oh crap, we're not very good at this. <laughs> Don't you know that I'm still standing better than ever did? Looking like a true survivor, feeling like a little kid. So good. Babushka, you've been great.